we shall get into the category 4 questions. Type 4. Let's understand questions when a money is divided among few people. Here is the first one. A man divides rupees 8600 among 5 sons, 4 daughters and 2 nephews. If each daughter receives 4 times as much as each nephew and each son receives 5 times as much as each nephew, how much does each daughter receive? Let's solve this. As both daughter and son are receiving more than the nephew, let's take nephew's value as x. Now, if nephew is x, then each daughter will receive 4 times of nephew, that is 4x. Similarly, each son will receive 5 times of nephew, so that is 5x. Now, the amount 8600 is divided among 5 sons, 4 daughters and 2 nephews. So, 5 into 5x, this is part of each son and there are totally 5 sons, plus 4 into 4x, 4 daughters and part of each daughter, plus 2 into x, there are 2 nephews and part of the nephew, this is what we have assumed. And we will equate this to 8600. And I am solving this 25x plus 16x plus 2x is equal to 8600 and this becomes 43x equal to 8600 and finally x will be 200. We got nephew's amount but is asking for how much does daughter receive? Each daughter's share is 4x. So on substituting the value of x here, we will be getting the daughter's share. Daughter's share is 4 into 200 which is equal to rupees 800. So each daughter will receive rupees 800. Let's solve another question. A sum of rupees 1360 has been divided among A, B and C such that A gets 2 by 3 of what B gets and B gets 1 by 4 of what C gets. Let's find out B's share. A, B and C are linked to each other. So if you assume the value of C, we can get A and B as well. So let's take the value of C as X. Now B's share will be X by 4 and A's share will be 2 by 3 times of B. So 2 by 3 into X by 4 which is equal to X by 6 rupees. So share of C is X rupees, share of B is X by 4 rupees, share of A is X by 6 rupees. Now a sum of rupees 1360 has been divided among A, B and C. Therefore X by 4 plus X by 6 plus X is equal to rupees 1360. We shall take the LCM and we get 17X by 12 is equal to 1360. Further solving this, we get x is equal to 1360 into 12 by 17. And finally, we get rupees 960. This is the value of C share. But is asking us to find out B share. That is x by 4. Therefore, B share is equal to 960 by 4 rupees, which is equal to rupees 240. This is the answer. In the next lecture, I will explain you the simplification of equations.